I'm Michelle Howe, I'm the Director of ABS Communication. So my team is responsible for all of the media and corporate communication activities of the ABS, which includes the Census. So the Census is conducted every five years by the ABS and it's the largest statistical collection that we undertake. So without full participation, we can't get an accurate snapshot of the nation. While the data is used by people who are used to using the data, so full government to inform decision making, the general public probably don't have a great level of awareness of what it is used for. So we developed Run That Town, I guess, as a new and innovative dissemination tool for the 2011 Census data release. So as a player, you can control any postal area in Australia and you basically have to make um, project or town building decisions. So it's not mock data, we pulled it from the census and um, put it into the back end of the game. So it tries to, one, I guess, show you in a sort of short simulation what a census is and how it is run and then also the importance of the data and what it can be used for. Well, we wanted to do something that was social media focused and based or that was experiential based out in the community and something that could maybe have an ongoing use and application between census periods that we could keep getting some sort of awareness um, and I guess brand recognition out of. So we brainstormed, we all cut up the data in different ways and looked at which ways you could use it. I guess the main challenges were keeping it on time, on track for when we wanted to release it and within budget like anything, there's just risk, the sort of standard risks with developing something that's got a lot of sort of technology and um, new platforms for someone like the ABS that we probably hadn't done a lot of work in in terms of mobile app. We managed that through working very closely with, we had a really great close relationship with our agency and they also subcontracted the technical development of the game to a game development specialist. It has a five star rating in the App Store, which as you know is through peer and player review. So far it's been downloaded by over 70,000 people um, and we're tracking that it's being downloaded at around 800 new users per month so that's a good I think achievement for us and we try to do some ongoing promotion to make sure we maintain that level of download.